Hey everyone, today we're going to talk about nitroglycerin and its benefits during myocardial infarction. Before we get started, I think we should probably review what's going on in the heart during a myocardial infarction. For some reason, whether it be that there's a blockage in an artery or there's a spasm that's bad enough to affect the circulation to the myocardium, so the heart muscle, for some reason there's a loss of blood flow to an area and that area then begins to die. Because as we know, uh, without oxygen, eventually cells are going to start to die as it is one of the things that we require. Without blood flow, that area is going to die, whatever area is distal to the heart being affected by the circulation or lack thereof. One of the medications we use to improve blood flow in the heart is nitroglycerin. So nitroglycerin is a vasodilator. What it does is it actually causes dilation of the blood vessels. It works better in venous, we think, um, than it does arteries, but it does have some effect on the arteries as well. With this dilation of the venous system, there gets to be a decrease in preload. This um, reduces the amount of blood that's returning to the heart and from that, it allows the heart to pump more effectively. And also, we need to remember that when the heart gets its circulation, it's during diastole. So if the heart pumps more effectively due to the decrease in preload, in theory, this should also allow the heart to have more circulation during diastole so that it beats more effectively and allows more blood to come back into the coronary circulation from the more effective beating. There is also some systemic arterial dilation. This in turn decreases the afterload. What this does is makes it so that the heart can again pump more effectively because it's pumping against less pressure, so the afterload is a little bit less. In turn, that should also increase the amount of circulation that goes back to the coronary arteries and then to the heart muscle. This is the benefit of giving your patient nitroglycerin during a myocardial infarction. Again, just a quick summary. We give the nitroglycerin to the patient. It causes vasodilation. From that vasodilation, we get a decrease in preload. And that, in turn, allows the heart to pump more effectively. There's a decrease in afterload, which again allows the heart to, de to pump more effectively. And then from that, it should increase the amount of circulation to go into the coronary circulation during diastole from the heart. Thanks very much and have a great day. We love that you love our videos and we appreciate you so much that we've actually created the EMT Illustrated notes for you. You can download these for free in our link in our bio.